Ah. Yay! What's up, guys, and welcome to this plugin tutorial on Skyblock. Oh yeah, I hope you guys like that intro I made. Yep. All right. Anyway, Skyblock, you guys should know it by now. It's it it is really a map where you have to survive on a small sky island and you're only given a certain amount of tools but this plugin is used for your server to have it for your players to play with other people and sh just yeah this is a multiplayer skyblock version it's for your server so you need three plugins this plugin vault world edit world guard some recommended plugins I really recommend you get this I have a tutorial on that so click on that link popping up right now and I'll go ahead and download those four required plugins right now so of course go ahead and download ultimate skyblog alright also download vault world edit world guard I have Vault, you don't really need a tutorial on that, so that's why I haven't done it. I have a tutorial on World Edit, World Guard, if you want to watch that. You don't have to, though. It's not really necessary for this plugin. So, yeah, go ahead and download all four of these plugins. And really try to get Multiverse Core, because that's a really good plugin. Alright, open World Guard and just drag the World Guard jar. That's all you need. Oops. Just drag it into your plugins folder. So right here, go ahead and open World Edit. Drag just the World Edit jar. Drag it into your plugins folder, and then drag Vault and U Skyblock in there too. Once you're done downloading all the files you need, scroll down to the bottom until you see Commands and Permissions. Make sure you put in your permissions for your groups to what you want this is about all the from here and up this is about for the default group or the member builder group this is normal not admin or moderator so set these permissions and then you'll be good to go all right after you got all four plugins in go ahead and restart your server alright go ahead and click on you skyblock the folder in your plugins folder and edit the config file alright first thing you'll see is the max party size this is for your players if they want to have a party just pretty much a group of people in one skyblock so for that's pretty decent the world name, Skyworld, which it should have generated a world in your server. I leave that as is. Cooldown restart. I leave that. The number of blocks between islands. You can change this depending on how much you want it. You can change all of this. What items come in the chest. Where the... How... Fought har And this is to change how far up the skyblocks are from the ground. Uh, bonuses, you can get extra items in chests, world guard, protection range, allow PvP. Do you want PvP? If you do, then put allow. Allow island lock. You can, people can lock their islands from preventing people to get in. Uh, that's all about good. Alright, once it's done, go ahead and restart your server again. So, in another world, you should create a lobby where it tells all the info, all the commands you have to type, set a little lobby. And besides that, you're pretty much done, but I'll show you what you can do from a player's perspective. So type in island to get an island. This will create your Skyblock island. See? Skyblock home has been set to your current location. Let's see what I got in the chest. Got quite a lot all of this of course in different chests there's different things because uh, of the extras that were in the config you can change that though so now you can set your islands home 
So island set home. And now all you have to do when you leave this world is type in slash island. You'll get now I just want to have a party. Let's get started. Let's invite some friends in. All right, slash island. Invite player name. Of course, there's no one else on the server, but if you have a friend, you won't, you can invite up to three people. So let's say it's my friend's name. Quite unique, huh? Players offline or doesn't exist. So what your friend what your friend will do is he'll either type slash island accept or island reject. He can type either one of those. If he doesn't like you, I'm pretty sure he'll say reject. If he likes to, he wants to join your party, then he'll hit accept. And if you want to leave your friend's party, go back to your island. You can type in slash island leave. Then you'll leave that island. And then there you have it. So thanks for watching this tutorial, guys. I hope this video helped. Like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks.